Sup guys, it is 2 Pro Games or Adam, and in this video I want to talk about will Black Ops 3 be on the PlayStation 3 and the Xbox 360? Now for my last video, this was the number one question people were asking me. Will it be on the 360 and the PlayStation 3? And I've been talking to a lot of people about this, not just recently, but over the course of the year, because it's been a lot of people have been asking. Will the next COD be exclusive to the current gen consoles? And by the way, current gen is the PS4 and Xbox One. Previous gen is the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360. So a lot of people do think that the next Call of Duty possibly could be only for current gen consoles. Now the way I look at it is as of right now, February 2nd, 2014 it will definitely change by of course November but not drastically not an absolute crazy change but it will definitely change but if the game was to be released right now it will absolutely 100% definitely be on both current gen and previous gen and I'll let you know why so as of right now again the PS4 has 4.7 million units sold the Xbox One has 3.3 million units sold. So a combined total of 8 million units sold for current gen consoles. That's not a crazy amount. Then when you look at the PS3 and the Xbox 360, the PS3 has 81 million units sold and the Xbox 360 is at 80.2 million. So a combined total of 161.2 million units sold. So if there's 161 million people playing on the previous gen and 8, 8 million people playing on the current gen, there's absolutely, it's, it's impossible for them to not release it on the 360 and the PS3. That would be absolutely the stupidest move you could make because there's just not enough people playing on the current gen. Like I said, the numbers will definitely change. Maybe maybe if the even if the numbers for xbox one and ps4 both had 10 million there's absolutely no way that they're not going to release it on the ps3 and the xbox 360. now what i think what they're going to do is they're going to release it on both on both gens current and previous but there will be restrictions on the previous gen there may i there probably will be more game modes on the current gen because the ps I said this in my last video, the PS4 and Xbox One have more power. Absolutely double the power, triple the power. And the PS3. So, on the PS3 and Xbox One, we'll be able to handle a lot of stuff. Like, ground war for Call of Ghost. There's no ground war on the on a previous gen. It's only on next gen. Why? Because the console can run it, run it better. So I think there's going to be a little bit more restrictions on the PS3 and Xbox One. But the basic things are going to be there. The zombie survival, um, the campaign and multiplayer. All of those things are going to be there. But maybe on next gen, for zombies, there's going to be some more game modes like TDM and Free For All and, and Grief and all these types of game modes. And on the on previous gen, it won't be there. And in multiplayer, there may be um, more more game modes, more I don't know customization, all this kind of stuff. A longer campaign, I don't know, probably not longer campaign, but little things like that will be on current gen that won't be on previous gen again because of the power of the console. So, anyways, guys, I hope this answered a lot of your your questions. And if you enjoyed the video, please do a thumbs up and subscribe for more Black Ops 3 information and news. Peace out.